So I'm Nico Lucote. I'm from Argentina. I've been a civic leader in my country. Uh, started with my first NGO involvement in the mid-80s when democracy was coming back. And uh, in my most recent uh, efforts, I've been trying to translate most of the skills and uh, causes I push from civil society uh, into political engagement and working from the political and democratic process uh, to try to improve both our electoral system and the outcomes of people's engagement through uh, elections and political practice in my local district and in the uh, districts where I've been able to work. Why the program came at, at such a good time for me because um, it uh, works in two dimensions. And the first pers very personal dimension is I moved from being a policy nerd, a policy wonk, a specialist in public policy to competing for uh, electoral office and for representing people with all the challenges of uh, democratic representation. You know, how much loyalty do you owe your party? How much do you owe to your conscience? How much do you owe to your electorate? How do you deal with all these different dynamics which are very typical of our uh, democratic representation challenges. This first uh, week, which was like a big refresher about the theories behind democratic uh, strengthening and weakening, um, economic development and democracy, the whole idea of how do we understand what we've been through in the past two or three decades in several developing countries to better face what comes ahead for us uh, and those of us who, who've had democracy for 15, 20 or 30 years. and contrasting that with those of countries that are getting democracy in a much later stage. In other programs I've participated, we have people who have more business interests or people who have uh, artistic interests, or, and there is not this common language or this common passion for issues of improving governance and you know the, the pillars of our uh, political development. So that's a very unique aspect of the, of the program. The second is that from the first session on, you have these amazing faculty like yeah, Frank Fukuyama, Larry Diamond, people that you've read about, people that you sort of uh, wanted to be able to engage on a one-on-one -on -one hand in your you know, uh, dreams of academic uh, stimulation. And here you have them uh, at arm's reach, uh, not only during the classroom, but also uh, when we walk out of the classroom and just being able to say, uh, listen, professor, I wanted to follow up with two or three and having half an hour conversation one-on-one -on, -one on something that clearly affects uh, your own district, country, or city. In translating the things that have worked for us to promote human rights, to promote environmental rights, to promote a series of um, different ways to engage uh, citizens in public affairs, we need to um, understand uh, with a much broader perspective how these things have worked elsewhere. And the program is so rich because of the diversity of my fellows and at the same time the common interests we have